So what is the movie technique? Well, it's a really fantastic tool to help you process emotions that may be still stuck around events and memories and remain unprocessed. So what I want you to do is think about a time that you might still feel mildly annoyed about or a bit anxious or a lot of anger around. It might be at work, it might have been at school, it may have been a conversation that you had this week, maybe a little bit further back and just be interested and see what pops into your head, what still niggles. Okay, just as an exercise, what I'd like you to do now is to imagine placing that scene, that moment, onto a movie screen for me. So imagine you've got a big movie screen and then throw the memory onto the movie screen and push it back to a space in front of you where it feels comfortable to look at, yeah? And then what we do is using the tapping sequence, we then tap through that memory until it has no charge left in it at all. So if you were to look at it now and see how much you still feel annoyed, if you were to try and measure it on a scale of one to 10, or maybe just using your hands, that can measure the intensity and see, okay, how annoyed do I still feel about this? And sometimes you might still be quite surprised at what emotional charge is still there, even if you think it's mild, because it can tap into bigger things, yeah? So looking at the scene, imagining where it is on the scale, just be interested, allow your mind to guess, yeah? If it's stronger than an eight, I want you to maybe not use that one, because that might be a bit too strong, okay? So just choose something perhaps seven or below, yeah? And you can always come back and replay this and give it a go, yeah? So what we do now, we've got our scene, just start tapping and talking it through in your mind, yeah? Talking the event through in your mind, what happened, what you said, what the scene was, who else was there, how you felt about it. Think of all the thoughts, the emotions that come up, might have been in your mind then, but, and now, when you think about it now, you know, were they stupid to say those things? Did you feel humiliated? The anger, yeah, everything. Thoughts, emotions, the scene itself, what's going on, and noticing what's coming up for you as you watch it. Okay. And then pausing, checking in and seeing what remains. So obviously this is gonna be over a period of time turn this video off, have a go, and then coming back and noticing what remains, okay? So often what might happen as shifts and changes happen, it's like the scene starts to fade a bit, it's not, the edges are softer, or it starts to dissolve, or it feels a bit more distant, or you just feel a bit more disinterested. So that's all shifts. Also the emotion, if there was anxiety or anger there, that will start to lessen and lower. So just notice what you see and notice what still stands out, okay? So maybe bring, if it feels comfortable to, bring the screen forward a little bit and sometimes that can help to pop out what is still remaining. And ideally what we want to do is to get it close to zero as possible or close to your hands being together as possible, yeah? And then just keep tapping on everything that remains the thoughts that come up, it's not fair, I hate them, I don't want to feel like this, whatever it is, or I'm not good enough, etc. And the emotions, are you angry, are you anxious, are you fearful, you know, are you feeling vulnerable, are you feeling ashamed, everything that's present and being and listening to it, being being honest with yourself, that's the key thing. You don't need to dilute this any any way, it's about listening to what's present, okay? And really noticing and then by the end hopefully I'm gonna guess using the technique you'll find that the emotions just shift and then you'll be able to look at that and say oh well that was in the past yeah it happened I'm just not that bothered anymore or you may not even be able to bring it to mind you may not feel interested at all anymore so that's the po point of the movie technique is to allow you to process everything that's still stuck and still hooked in to those memories. It may be in the past in terms of our lifetime, but our mind remembers and it may not have digested everything yet. So give it a go. It's a very powerful technique, even though it seems simple. Good luck. 
I'm Nicole and if you like this video please subscribe, please like it and share it with your friends because I'm going to be sharing lots more healing knowledge with you soon.